I'm Dan Galusha and welcome to another edition of Shoot and Plank. Hey, we're in a little bit different spot today. Same location, but a little bit different. We've been working on things and uh, show you some photos here. This right here where we're at is the new air gun 25 yard range. And over here where I'll be showing you is the place where we're going to be shooting shorter range and also knife throwing. Uh, and we're working, and I'll show you some photos here, of the new Cedar Oaks area, which is going to be for our 22s and up to 9 millimeter probably. Uh, but uh, that, like I said, we're still working on that. I've been digging some earth pits, which you can see here. Uh, also, we're going to be putting in a board area that goes inside that pit. It's going to be a 25 yard range. Got some knife throwing areas over there too. So, uh, and what we're going to do today though is we're going to be shooting and we're going to just see how this buck mark, this is an Umarex buck mark, how it works at 25 yards. We're going to shoot at 10, 15, and 25. We know that at 10 it should hit. No problem at all, but we're going to go back to 25 as well, and we're going to be shooting that. But first, I want to take you over to the other one, so uh, let's go over there, and I'll show you what we got over there. Okay, as you can see, this is the old location, but we rebuilt things. Uh, I got this right here. Lay this down. We've got this right here. This is our knife throwing range, and down here is that uh, target that... Uh, Brandon Rogola made for us and we've decided what we're going to do with that. That's not going to be a knife throwing target. That is going to be the backup for air guns. The reason being is that the wood is very very hard. Too hard actually for knife throwing. So we're going to go with this cotton wood right now but Brandon's building a new one so we'll show you that later. But uh, hey, let's go shoot this uh, Umarex Buckmark and just see what it does at 25 yards and we're going to be firing it, I don't know if you noticed behind me over there but we're going to be firing it at the Air Venturi gong target the 1-4 air guns so uh, let's go shoot okay we're here at uh, 10 yards and we're going to, uh, I know we're going to hit it here and I'm using RWS hobby pellets by the way of course you know that's one of my favorites anyway so uh, we got that cocked we got it ready uh, gonna adjust my buck mark sight here so that I got good enough red dot to see put my eye protection on don't forget that uh, don't need ear protection for the air guns and then we'll just see what it does knew that it hit at 10 let's go back to 15 Oh, we're back to 15. You're right alongside me. I've been moving this camera with me. So now we'll see what happens. Got it. That's 15 yards. So we'll load it up here. Of course, this is a brake barrel. So Now, we'll go back to 25. Alrighty. We're all the way back to 25 now. Got it ready. Let's see what she does. Hit it. Took a while to get there, didn't it? But by golly, it hit it from 25 yards, and that's with the uh, Umarex bug mark. Hey, that's not bad. Not sure where it hit, but I'm sure you've seen it. Well, I'd say that old uh, Umarex buck mark did a pretty doggone good job, but it's one of my favorite air pistols, and at 25 yards, it's hitting the Air Venturi with the RWS pellets, by the way, because uh, I always like those RWS hobby pellets when I really want to do some good shooting. Those just seem like they're, I don't know why, but they just work great for me. And you got to see some of the new areas that we're going to be shooting, too. And I'm not going to be taking you out to Cedar Oaks right away. we got some more work, as you can see. And uh, But once we do, it, you know, it's got a good spot for knife throwing. we got it right here, which I've already showed you. Uh, we got everything for the knife throwing, for the air gun shooting, the firearm shooting. So uh, we're going to be doing a few more at those different locations, and you're going to be seeing them. So until next time, shoot safe and throw safe and have a great...